Hi, welcome to another segment of Magoosh GRE Tips. Today, I'm going to be talking about quantitative comparison, specifically as it relates to geometric figures. And I know this is an area that totally freaks people out because first they think, hey, look, those two triangles look exactly the same. See, and then they learn that the figure can be manipulated and drawn in many different ways, and then they totally lose it. What do you mean? Is it even a triangle? Is it even a square? Can I trust anything? It becomes like a conspiracy theory. So it's not conspiracy theory. The GRE does have ground rules. First off, yes. Do not, for no reason, ne ever assume that drawing is to scale. It is not. It is meant to throw you off. However, if it says triangle ABC, then don't say, hmm, I'm going to make triangle ABC into a trapezoid. That is violating. Okay, so that's the most fundamental level. You cannot rearrange the actual shape of the figure. Next, you want to make sure that when you have these figures, that you pay attention to any information that's given. I call this parameters. For instance, AB equals BC in a triangle. Then AB has to equal BC. You cannot violate that. And so oftentimes, a good rule of thumb is if there's hardly any information given, or maybe sometimes no information whatsoever, then the answer is D. Not always, but usually. The more information, the less ambiguity, the less likely it is to be D. So good, good tip to keep in mind. Also, orientations of figures. So there's a little rhombus, whoop, tilt it over like that. Can't necessarily tilt it over that way and reconstruct angles. So make sure you adhere to that as well. And if you do so, you should be able to manipulate figures any way you can. So if something looks like a square, for instance, if there's no parameters, there aren't any parameters, you can go whoop and make it look like a rectangle unless it says square ABCD. Or if it says AB is twice BC, then maybe you'll have a rectangle like this. But if not, you can manipulate it as long as you don't add sides or twist it upside down and warp it into some novel shape.